JC Max. Este. Va. Mm. I love it. And I can't wait to try it. So, yeah. so do you want to say anything to the community, Saudi community, anything? Oh. So they asked me, what else, JC Max? How else are you gonna show the Salvis some love? Well, here I am in the heart of Los Angeles, California on Union Avenue to try some authentic Salvadoran food, which we have here called La Papusa Urban Eatery. I've heard that the owners were born in the United States but show the love of the culture of El Salvador here in the heart of Los Angeles. So, join me and find some great food, because today, I'm ready. Let's do it. Let me not get hit, though. Hola, senor. All right, let's see what we got going on here. One person on the town wait here, six feet apart. Not a lot of people here today. So when I was in El Salvador, they told me I should get like a penny and like tap on the window, but I don't really need to do that. I can just go like this. I don't even think that worked at all either. Oh, hola. Uh, hold on. <laughs> I'm sorry. Puedo grabar aqui? Yeah. Si? No sé qué necesitas. It's okay? Okay, because I want to try some authentic El Salvador food oh. at this restaurant. It's my first time, primera vez. Oh, okay. So... Check the menu. All right. On this list, I push the And so I'll just click it yes. when when I'm ready. Uh -huh. Gracias. Where are you from? Okay. Where are you from? De donde eres? San Salvador. San Salvador? Yes. San Salvador. Ah, buenas. Yes. Yeah. I like El San Salvador. It's good. Yeah? Yes. What's the... Hmm? Ya fue? Si! Sí. Oh, see? Yes! Mm. Cibar, San Miguel, La Union, everywhere. Oh, wow. Sí. Okay. So, Good. that's why I want to try something different that I did not try in El Salvador. So, I want to see what's, what's, what's the best to eat at lunchtime for al almuerzo. What's the um, best to eat? Everything, yeah. Mexicana. Mexicana? You know, you know what? I rarely get soup. Soup de gallina. So you have some, some chicken soup? Yes, chicken soup. Okay, where, where's that on here? How, how much is that? Some $14 okay, soup? Here. Free range. Argentina. You know what? Yes. See, si, $14. Yes. So what I'll do, since you mentioned it, I will try the sopa de gallina. <laughs> and that's it for now. Okay? Yeah. See, si, that's it. Okay. And then um, there's no internal seating. Everything is to go, see? Yeah. Okay, no problem. Okay. All right. So um, we'll, we'll try that. Okay. okay gracias. And then, let's get out my reserves. Hola, buenas tardes. Hola, buenas tardes. All right. <laughs> so, how long have you been working here? How long have you been working here? Oh, we got about four years of being here almost. Four years? And you're, are you one? Yeah. Hi, I'm JC. Hey, JC. Yeah, so I, come, I wanted to come and showcase your store. Oh, cool. So okay. I heard that you and your wife started this place? Yeah. Okay, so um, usually I, I've traveled to like El Salvador and all these places, so I wanted to, you know, show you some love. Okay, that sounds great, man. Thank yes. you for coming through. No problem. So are you familiar with YouTube? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm on YouTube, so one day I might put this on the internet. Oh, so. Yeah. Do you have a phone? I'll show yeah, you. Yeah, what's your okay. YouTube channel? Uh, JC Max. You know, let people know that you're here because I know this whole area is usually is, is Korean and Salvador. So yeah, yeah, that's me. So I, I usually vlog about what I eat. So okay. today I'm going to get the sopa de gallina. Okay. And I can't wait to try it. So. Yeah. You, you were just out there right now. Recently. Yes, yes, yes. How, how is it out there right now? It's wonderful. All right, bro. Thank you, bro. No, no, definitely. All right. definitely no. I can't wait to taste it. Thanks. Our, our thing is about being, you know, like, uh, like just being different. So. Absolutely. So. So while in there, I did mention that I would like to have a drink. So Juan, the owner, decided, hey, the best to get is a passion fruit. So I'm letting you know how it tastes. Let's do it. Mukbang. Now that's good. I like this passion fruit because you can really taste like the passion. Like it doesn't have too much sugar. And it's like, and that's the best thing that you want. If it's too much sugary, then it's not as authentic as it should be. So it has essentially 
the, the right amount of fruit tastes without too much sugar. So if you're looking for a good drink here at this restaurant right behind me, get the passion fruit drink. I like it. It's really good. So I'll rate this a 8 out of 10. It's good. Okay. All right, guys. Opening this up, I'm showing that we have some tortillas. It shows that there's a difference between what I saw in El Salvador because this seems a tad bit fluffier. So it's fine. Normally I say I don't like tortillas that much, but I'm willing to try it and see how it tastes. So below the, the tortillas, I see we have our sopa de gallina. All right, so I'm just gonna do a quick taste here, just a quick little mukbang, and show you how it tastes. Ooh, it's hot. Let's, let's not drop it. Whoa. All right. And so underneath, Wow, we were able to get something special that the chef recommended. So Jose definitely let me know, hey, we want to show you something new. And I see we have some chicken with some rice and some leaves. So let's go ahead and try the sopa de gallina. Table's a little bit too high. Uy. All right, guys, sopa de gallina from La Papusa Urban Eatery. Uy. All right. So first, I always want to thank God for allowing me to get here safely and at the same time allowing me to have enough money to pay for this meal. Thank you, Lord, for everything that you do. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So, sopa de gallina. So inside the sopa, it seems like we have some, I'm not sure, what is this, um, yuca or, I'm not sure, potatoes, who knows. So we have, I don't know if this is parsley or whatever, we got cucumbers. I don't know. You guys in the comment section can let me know what's inside of it. I don't know. I just want to taste it. I don't see the gallina though. Maybe maybe it's like chicken sauce broth? I don't see the chicken. Some of you are gonna laugh at me and say oh no that's how it is. Sopa de gallina doesn't have chicken in it but I don't know. Maybe it does. I don't feel it. Either way let's stop stalling and have a taste. Let's do it. Here you go. <laughs> it's hot. I should have waited to get some of this passion fruit drink. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. It's hot. I should have waited. Ah. Woo. Okay. Sorry, guys. But from that taste, that's all I'm going to taste right now because I don't want to hurt myself. The soup is light. So, overall, I like it for the fact that it's not too heavy. So if you're looking for a great afternoon meal, I definitely would say try the $14 sopa de gallina because it's a, it's a light soup. It's not chunky. It's not gonna like make you feel full as from what I can tell after that first sip. So definitely this is a great lunch option, okay? So, and it definitely is very tasty. Um, but for some, like I'm Haitian, I would definitely probably put some hot spice on it or hot sauce because I'm into that, all right? So Jose let me know about a different dish here. So we have our chicken and our rice. Let's go ahead and eat that. Very good. Not too much salt on the rice. And it has a little bit of mixed vegetables inside too. I rarely see that in rice these days. Mixed vegetables is definitely something. I always love my rice. Hmm. So with this, we have our, I don't know what you call this, parsley, vegetables, lettuce, I don't know. I don't know the names of green things, I'm just going to eat it. <laughs> Yummy. It's good. Let's just go ahead and get to the chicken. Got some lemon. Mmm. Quick eat, quick eat. Mmm. I love it. People in the comment section is always like, you know, you're supposed to just bite it and compliment your meal. Now I'm gonna do it this time. Bum. It's good. Tortilla for the win. All right, guys. Let's rate the food. The soup, I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10 because it's good. Better. It doesn't have that much of a zing to it. I love just spices. So, 7 out of 10. For this, 
I'm a Haitian, I love my chicken and rice. I went to El Salvador for culture and chicken. I'm gonna give this an eight out of 10. All right guys, thank you very much for this mukbang. This is here, Los Angeles, California. La Papusa, Urban Eatery. Have a blessed day, guys. Bonus. Like right. 20 years ago, so I haven't been out there since. Oh man. But I used to go as a kid, like I used to go a lot, like like during the war and after the war. Right. And I got to go, I remember like, going like a little bit right after the war, it was crazy because you could run out and be playing and nothing right. happened. Gangs weren't even around yet because yes. you know, they were even too scared of the, the, the Right. But it was cool back then, but had, a lot's changed even the, the last couple of years that I went. Mickey D. Yeah. You, know, you know, all that, all that. You know, all the stuff that we're used to seeing, name brand, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wonderfully. Yeah, it was fine. You know, um, gangs, I didn't really see them at all. You know, I've encountered some members here and there, but no one bothered me. Yeah. You know, but even then, there's not no violence. I was able to walk the streets wonderfully fine without any issues. So, if you wanted to go out there, go. I, I would say, don't be scared. No, no, no. no we're we're already planning. I totally understand. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, I feel like I feel to go back soon. I just left, but I'll go back again. I love it. You know, it's a great place. I want to let everyone know to go because everyone's so scared. They're like, oh my goodness, yeah. the gangs are gonna, you know. But no, no. It's, you know yeah. what? It, it, it's the same thing like here. Right. They're out there. You're not mm -hmm. gonna. If you're not gonna go put yourself in that place, you'll be all right. Exactly. Nobody's gonna really mess with you. No one messes with yeah, yeah. So I'm happy to see that you guys are doing your own thing and thank you, thank and, you. and thriving. So you know, yeah. I'm gonna show you guys some love. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, like, like mm -hmm. us is it was just basically like I, I learned from my grandma, mm -hmm. and, she, and she grew up with her grandma cooking. She, her grandma used to right. get on the streets. Right. So both of us came, you know, with, with being in the kitchen and, and learning all that. Mm -hmm. And I was fortunate enough that my, one of my uncles had a restaurant. Right. He sold it to my parents. Right before I graduated high school. Oh, that's here? Start, yeah, here. Yes. That's starting the experience, you know, and, and right. you know, doing everything. And then we opened up another one, and, and then my parents retired a couple of years ago. Mm. At the same time, my, time my grandma passed away. And, right. Yeah, so then they retired and they wanted out of it, and we we're like, you know, we're still looking, I guess, to fulfill what we felt like we, we needed to do. With right. It. Just try to bring the connection that we're like, you know, we were, and, and where our culture was, and our LA culture, and like, right. how we felt. like that we could translate what we saw at LA being like to us. Right. Yeah. Well, I hope you get more business and I hope more people know about this place. Did you want to say anything to the community, Salvi community, anything? Oh, mucho gusto a todos que aquí estamos aquí para saludarlos y ojalá que vengan a visitarnos. Ah, you hear that accent? That's a Salvi accent. Don't, don't, don't think that just because he's from here that he ain't got it. No, he I got don't. it. <laughs> exactly. All right, bro. Thank you, bro. No, no, definitely. All right. definitely. More bonus features. So the guy asked me, he wants to take a photo of me in my Salvadorino shirt. So we'll do that today. Ah. No problemo. Okay. <laughs> yes. But gracias. Gracias a usted. Ah, no problemo. ¿Qué departamento es um, de este? Usulután. Oy, I was in Usulután. Uh -huh. ¿Qué, qué, ¿Qué parte? Uh, Puerto El Triunfo. Oh, Triunfo. I was in uh, Puerto Parada. Puerto Parada? Sí. Sí, La Pirraya. Sí. Okay. Yo tengo un video con Puerto Parada. ¿Sí? Sí. Oh, qué bueno. Yes, no problem. Hey. ¿Cuál es tu nombre? Jose Andino. Jose, gracias. Jose, hey. mi nombre es JC Max. JC hey. Max. JC Max. Okay. Está listo. Okay. Do you want someone to take a photo of us? Ah, todo. Tiene. Buscar. Para verlo en. Okay, JC Max. Este. Va. Ahí lo puedo ver a usted. Okay. okay, so let me show you my película in. Usulutan, Victor. Bye. Adios. Adios. De nada.